Dear friend, do we have the right as Christians, as Bible-believing Christians, to take time off, to entertain ourselves, to play games, when every second of every day there are people dropping into hell for all eternity. My friends, I think about myself and I think about, uh, every time I start thinking about this way, it's like the devil gets on my shoulders and says, you know, you're not worthy, you're, you're so filthy, rotten, and wicked. But I tell you what, the Lord wants to use every single one of us to get his word out, to point people to the Lord Jesus Christ before it's everlasting too late. Hell is real, my friend, and it lasts forever. I listened to a great message. You can find it on YouTube called Five Surprises in Hell. Dr. Ruffman, listen to it. Be encouraged, but be be motivated. Be, uh, be encouraged that there are people going to hell. My friend, I had, a, I had somebody tell me uh, just the other day, not even yesterday, that there might be football in heaven. My friend, what a ridiculous even thought to think that there's going to be a bunch of men in tights slapping each other's rear ends and breaking each other's bones while you sit back on the couch and drink beer and watch them play. The idolatry, the, the wickedness, the, the, uh, the amount of church uh, that has been missed because of these stupid games. You think the Lord likes that? My friend, I think there's going to be a lot of surprises in heaven, not, not, not just in hell. In hell, the biggest surprise is going to be that you're there if you're not saved. So make sure that you're saved, that the blood of Jesus Christ has cleansed you from every sin. And again, I don't deserve it. I'm, I'm filthy. I'm rotten. But I thank God for the blood of Jesus Christ, who is, uh, who is just as far as east is from the west, has forgotten my sins. Amen. Have a good weekend, guys. Tell your mom hi, and, and if you have one still alive, and your wife, she's a mother, tell her, tell her that you love her. Tell her you appreciate her. Tell someone about Jesus. Talk to you all later. We don't have time to play.